How to keep fit during the quarantine. When you got your son, your daughter, your grandma, your grandpa, your wife, your dog, your cat, and your snake. Today we're gonna focus on full body workout, but with no impact so that every member of your family can do it. And I'm gonna give adaptations or scaling versions for those who are a little bit, little bit lower level. Let's go. Now we're gonna do the cockroach. It's very simple. It's a great exercise for you to strengthen your core. What you're gonna do is you're gonna point your hands and your feet towards the ceiling, like this. One and two. Give it a palm apart from the feet and a palm apart from the hands, and you're gonna bend your feet. So you're gonna bring your toes to you and not extend the feet, like this. One and two, and stay here for 20 seconds. <sighs> this was the first round. Now we're gonna go to the second round. Second round will be, you're gonna open it all and keep a palm from the floor on the feet and on the hands. So, original position, and now open everything, keep your core very tight, and now close, and open, and close. One more, open, close. Do eight to 10 repetitions. Last one, I'm gonna screw the hell out of your brain. You're gonna lower your right arm and lower your left leg at the same time. Keeping the other two pointing at the ceiling. Don't lose your position on the other. So from here, original stance, Lower your right leg and your left arm and keep the others very straight, pointing to the ceiling. Come back and then the other way around. Come back and the other way around. Back the other way and for a total of 10 repetitions. Ah. Now we're gonna step right into a superset of lunges and push-ups. So the perfect lunge is done in a way that your torso is gonna be straight, you're not gonna lean forward or backwards. And once you go down, your knee kisses the floor, just a little kiss, and you're gonna grab or you're gonna hold a 90 degree position either on the front and on the back. If somebody's not used to doing this, I would recommend a pillow in order to be very safe. You're gonna, get, you're gonna do it 10 times on the right leg and then switch 10 times on the left leg. And as soon as you finish, you go right into the push-ups. The advanced, I'm not worried about you guys. You can even put a backpack on. You know that you're in a plank position. You touch the chest on the floor and then you extend your arms. But for those who are beginners, I would recommend the pillow underneath your knees and just go like this extend, like this, extend. You're gonna feel your chest, triceps and shoulders working, 
And I'm gonna recommend three supersets of this. So from one exercise, you go right onto the other and you only rest for one to one minute and a half tops. I said tops, little Timmy. Now for this next segment, we're gonna do a superset of sumo deadlift and rowing. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna open your feet wide, and I mean wider than your shoulders a little bit, and you're gonna point them outward a little bit as well. Your arms fall down like this, and you're gonna go as low as you can, keeping your knees outside. You're gonna go as low as you can and come back up like so. If it's too easy, you can either use books, a little bit of weight, you can use bottles of water or a gallon of water, or you can use obviously a backpack with a lot of weight on it like this and go down and up and down and up. Notice how I'm having a little bit of a midpoint in between a squat, a regular straight squat and a deadlift. So I'm pushing my butt a little bit backwards while I'm doing it, but the object or my hands will be in between my feet in line with the in between or the midsole. Now, right after that, a towel. With a towel, you're gonna grab it. You're gonna, if it's too wide of a, to a towel, you're gonna split it. You're gonna grab the ends. You're gonna do this sort of strength as if you wanted to rip the towel apart. And from here, you're gonna bend at the hip, bend your feet a little bit, bend your legs a little bit. And from here, you're gonna go and pull it to your belly button. Really feel the squeeze on your shoulder blades and you're gonna do 10 repetitions. If it's too easy, you can do it, obviously, with some weight, like this. Three times this whole superset. Ah. Thanks, Bruce. Fist bump. Ah. Stay strong, stay safe. Keep home, but keep active and stay willow strong.